हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वील स्टार्ट द चेंजिंग वर्ल्ड ऑफ विजुअल आर्ट चैप्टर टेन फ्रॉम आर हिस्ट्री नाउ इन दिस चैप्टर वी वुड स्टडी अबाउट द आर्ट ऑफ प्रिंटिंग एंड प्रिंट मेकिंग द आर्ट ऑफ पेंटिंग बिकम अ सोर्स टू एक्सप्लेन वंस आइडिया और फीलिंग ऑफ ऑन द पिक्चर सो पेंटिंग पेंटिंग इज अ आर्ट that is a source to explain a person's idea or feeling through the picture so basically there were three aspects in painting or print making from the 18th century european artist brought with them new style and new convention of painting they started a new art of painting which is called oil painting oil painting enable artist to produce image that looks real so the arts or the paintings which used by european which is called oil painting are more are more real and presented in a good manner that oil paintings are more more realistic now pictures cue the basic concept was pictures cue to paint landscape in this time european painter were interested to paint the glory of british era in india one of the famous painters of this time were thomas daniel and his nephew william daniel in their journey from kolkata to northern and southern india they painted all the british glory they saw now portraits the tradition of art that become popular in colonial india was the portrait painting both british and indian wanted to see themselves on canvas portraits are the kind of vertical paintings okay so pictures cue are landscape and portraits are of vertical style one of the most famous of the european painters was john joffney who born in germany and migrated to england and came to india for 5 years in all the paintings indian are shown in fur as serving their white masters while british are shown as superior so you may see in all paintings indians are shown like they are serving their white masters and britishers are shown as superior now the third category of imperial art was called history painting so the first category was pictures cue which was of landscape second was portraits portraits that was vertical style that was in vertical styles and third category was history painting this history paintings once again celebrated the power of british their victories and their supremacy in the given painting you may see the mir zafar nawab of murshidabad who was the puppet ruler of britishers the british has defeated sirazuddaula in battle of plassey and installed mir zafar as the nawab of murshidabad it was a victory won by conspiracy and mir zafar was awarded the title of nawab now in the given figure you may see the storming of sirangapatnam as you all know about tipu sultan who was the most powerful enemies of the britishers he was finally defeated in 1799 at the battle of sirangapatnam see the way battle skin is painted the painting dramatizes the event and glorifies the british trumps now who were the court artist court artist were different somehow the artists from the court of tipu sultan painted not only their local styles but also mural painting mural painting so what is the term mural mural painting is the art to draw on a wall okay so mural painting is painted on a wall 
in the in this picture in the given picture hyder ali victory you may see the hyder ali's victory over the english army and it, it is shown throughout the wall painting okay now uh, in this painting you may see the painting of a village or indians uh, now these paintings are painted because now the british officials wanted to understand the lifestyle of indians for that purpose local painters painted the images of local plants animals historical buildings monuments festivals and processions caste and communities so all these pictures were known as company paintings now the new popular indian art in the region of kalighat a popular indian art known as scroll painting developed now scroll painters who are the scroll painters scroll painters were called patwas they were known as kumars in eastern india and kumhars in north india what is scroll painting in scroll painting you have a big size painting that can be scrolled so basically this scroll painters or patwas of kalighat made fun of the westernized babus they expressed the anger of common people against the britishers now during the same time photography involved this photographs initially shown the victory of britishers but the idea of nationalism also started these photographs shown the cultural diversity of india Raja Ravi Verma who belonged to the family of the maharajas of Travancore in Kerala he was the artist who created modern and national both styles he mastered the western art of oil painting and realistic life study but later he rejected by the nationalist artist Abindranath Tagore and Rabindranath Tagore they felt that a genuine india style of painting had to drawn inspiration from known western art tradition and captured the spiritual essence of the east they were also influenced by the art of japanese artists so their art turned to indian traditions of miniature painting and ancient art of mural painting which we can see in the ajanta caves